Hi everybody, this is Max Swiss TV. You are together with you, you are teacher Peter. The lesson of today is about changing from base M to base N. For example, we can have moving from base base 2 to base there's a 5. In the last video, you have seen how to move from base 10 to any base. And you have seen how to move from also any base to base 10 also. So today, we are going to see how we can move from this base to another base we, without mentioning that it is moving from that base to base 10 or from base to such base so these are the two important steps that you can follow to convert from base m to base n the two steps step one here we have steps Where step one is to convert from base M from a base M to base ten. The step two. is to convert it from base 10 to base n from base 10 to base n You see, we are combining the videos we have seen before to understand better, to understand well. Let's have an example. An example here it is to convert. 514 we win base 8 to base 9. This is 514 in the base 8 must be changed in base 9. What you have to do here it is from a base. Uh, 8 to base 10. We have seen the ways of moving from any base to base 10 where we deal with the multiplication. The first step it is to find the values of these digits. We have 5 times a times 8 plus 1 times 8 plus 4 times 8 with 0, 1, and 2. This one we will have will be 5 times 64 plus 8 plus 4, which is giving us 3, 3, 2. This is in base 10. It means 514 in the base 8 is equal to 3, 3, 2, 10. Then now, change this one to base 9. 
so what we need here is to change from base 10 to base 9 and remember that from base 10 to any base we are dealing with the division we are dividing now let's have 3 3 2 divided by 9 if we divide this by 9 we are having um, it is a 3 3 will be 0 3 it is a 6 6 will be having remainder of 8 then 36 over 9 divided by 9 we will have 4 this 4 will have remainder of 0 4 divided by 9 this 4 is very small to 9 we have 0 here we have 0 as an answer then 4 will become a remainder we have 4 it means our solution will be 408 within base 9 so 332 in base 10 is equal to 408 in base 9 it means now Five one four within the base eight, as we have in our in our example, it is in the base eight is equal to four zero eighty in the base nine. This is the way of changing from a base. M to base N. We have considered base M. Base M here is base 8 and base N is base 9. Moving from base M to base N. So this is the way we do it. Changing any number in the base M and change it to base N. Thank you for watching. Welcome again in the following videos. Like this one, share it, hit the notification bell so that you will be always receiving our new uploaded videos. Thank you very much. Bye bye.